Hey guys, welcome back. Today on The Untidy Artist, we're making a raspberry peach sugar scrub. I thought this would be a fun way to wrap up the summer. This is a really fresh and just yummy scrub that you can use on your feet and all over your body, and it's full of a lot of really great fresh ingredients. So let's grab some supplies and get started. The first thing you'll need is obviously some sugar, and I just grabbed this from my kitchen. And sugar is a lovely exfoliant. It's gonna work really well to help uh, get off all the dead skin. And then we'll need some sweet almond oil. And I have some dried raspberries. These are free dried raspberries. And we're gonna be breaking them up so they'll make a really nice exfoliant. And then because this is a raspberry peach scrub, I also have some freeze dried peaches. And once again, we'll be crumbling these up also and they'll help to exfoliate the skin as well. I will be using some raspberry extract because there's no such thing as raspberry essential oil and some peach flavor because I want to give it that yummy raspberry peach scent. Then I'll need a small bowl and a bigger bowl for mixing our scrub and a spoon and a small whisk and some measuring cups. I have a 1 4 measuring cup and a 1 cup measuring cup and then a teaspoon and a tablespoon. The next step is completely optional. I have some hibiscus flowers. Um, we'll be making a little tea out of these. You could also use, obviously, hibiscus tea. What this is going to do is a couple of things. It's going to give us this gorgeous red color for our scrub. Hibiscus is also very, very good for your skin. It's filled with natural um, alpha hydroxy acids, or AHAs, which increase moisture, improve flexibility and elasticity of the skin, and it's also filled with a whole bunch of antioxidants. So you can see here, I'm just putting a few of the hibiscus flowers into my little tea maker here, and I'm pouring some hot water over it. The water will steep and will give it this really gorgeous red color. So while that's steeping, go ahead and grab your sugar and measure out one cup of the sugar into your larger bowl. And then I'm taking about one teaspoon of my peaches that I've just crushed up with my fingers. And I'm going to do the same thing with the raspberries. So just break them up with your fingers. You could even use um, a rolling pin to just smash them up. So I have one teaspoon of the dried peaches and one teaspoon of the dried raspberries. And these are freeze dried so they break up really easily. And you can see the gorgeous red and yellow color that this gives our scrub. Now we're going to measure out one fourth cup of our sweet almond oil, and I just got this at my grocery store. And I'm going to take my hibiscus tea, and if you don't make the tea, you can just use water, but I'm going to measure out two tablespoons of my tea. And then I'm adding one teaspoon of the raspberry extract and one to two drops of the peach flavoring. This is really strong. Um, it's a flavoring used for candies and a food flavoring, so it is food grade. And then I'm going to grab my whisk and just give it a good stir. And you're going to whisk all of the oils together with the water. Um, you'll be emulsifying this, which means blending the water and the oils together, so really give it a good whisk. And then dump it in with your sugar and give it a good stir. Now, mine was a little thin for my liking, um, so I'm going to add a little bit more sugar to it. If you like your scrubs to be more scrubby, add more sugar. If you like them to be a little bit smoother, then uh, just obviously leave it the way that it was, but you can really control how scrubby or how smooth your scrub is by the amount of sugar you add. And that's it, guys. This honestly looks and smells yummy enough to eat. It is a really fresh way to brighten up your skin. I'm going to throw this in a little mason jar. This may makes a lovely gift and it's just really a fun way to end your summer on a sweet and happy note. This is honestly one of my favorite sugar scrubs I've made. If you would like to check out some of my other sugar scrubs or other tutorials, you can do that at untidyartist.com or on my YouTube channel. As always, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate your support. If you haven't already subscribed, please do give this a thumbs up if you liked it. And once again, guys, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time.